YouTube, what is going on? I am back with another video, and once again, once again, I got Armand and Essie to the left and right of me. At the glass table. Oh, yeah, that's smooth. At the glass table. Yes. So, y'all, as you see, we got crab legs, and look, we hungry again. We don't be eating all day. Like, we, we, we snack every now and then, but we don't eat, eat. Man. So, y'all, today is about 8 o'clock, and we eating right now. So, like, comment, subscribe, you know, smash that like button, comment, whatever you got to comment. Let's get to it. Let's go, man. So, what's the topic today? Thank you, Jesus. Stop. Amen. Oh, yeah. Amen. Amen. Well, uh, topic today. What is the topic for today? Is anything crazy happening right now? Anybody getting new new songs on rapping, R and B, anything? Nothing. Um. Ooh, mm -hmm. Oh my god. I'm good, baby. Well, so this sauce that they be putting on is just like crazy. I don't even know what's the sauce called. Dog shit. Let me going crazy. Mm. <laughs> What's she doing? Mm -mm -mm. You know, a cockroach is a a crab's cousin. Dude, what the fuck? No. Mm -hmm. Is it a cockroach? Mm -hmm. Is it crab's cousin? Yeah. Oh. Wow. A little roachy. Oh. I'm about to get your big crab cake head ass on. Crab cakes are good. Crab cakes are good. Professional. Crab cakes, man. Oh, you bro. You never had crab cake? You never had crab cake? Yeah. That shit's fire. Alright, I need a fork. I'm not a professional. At all. Actually, just get the um. The crap, the little scissors, that will help you out. The little scissors? They're over there by the, the, by the stove. There we go. To crack the crab. Oh. Come out of there. So, whoa. See me? Don't get me wrong, when it comes to these, oh, you need them. But other times, man. I just go iggity wiggity most smiggity. But yeah, man. <laughs> iggity wiggity. Oh, so let's, so oh, let's chat it up. Did you, you think I was going to be a, a dad this soon, bro? Mm -mm. Did I think so? Yeah. No. Why, Josh? He was much of a player? Nah. Wow. Well, he has to be a player for what? He always says that. You say that, bro? You a player? Well, then he nah, had so I many just, cute girls. I don't girls. know. I just didn't expect it. I mean. He's young, so I'm never Maybe gonna Trey, huh? It. No, not Trey. Neither one of them. But I mean, stuff happens in life, so. Like love. Right. Because it happened out of love. Love, true love. Mm, mm. Well, I haven't mm. even like dove into this crab yet. Well, you got this fire. <laughs> and they, didn't want, they didn't want no rice, but I got steak and rice too because you know I'm feeding too. The rice is good though. So you I talk about I'm feeding too. <laughs> and I just be hungry 24 90. 24 90? What is that? I heard 24-7. That's just exaggerating, Josh. Mm. Right, let my girl be. <laughs> That's why I forgot but I got I also got water because this is for me and this is for the baby. You always come out with you little nigga got. I forget. Josh, what would you do if you had a baby on the way? Um, be happy, be healthy. Be excited. Happy. You would be happy for real Tell right him now? not to eat hot Cheetos. <laughs> You would be happy right now, for real. Why would I not be happy? If it was just like on some, like you didn't expect it type stuff. Well, still, I'm gonna be happy. That's good, right answer. Of course. I did it to myself, if it's an accident or whatever, but. Facts. Oh, I would definitely take care of the kids. 
Uh, got you. You're gonna be my friend. All right. My dad. My dad would kick my ass. Right. I don't play that. That's one thing about me, though. All right. You would never hear me talking about telling my man, oh, this, never. that. Hell no. You can't, don't. Mm -mm. I don't give a fuck. What happened with you and that mama? It's on you. Hey, I'm that type of friend too, but in a girl version because I'm never gonna. Well, I don't believe in abortion for one, but. I mean, don't get me wrong. Sometimes it ain't the right time or. Well, not the right time. It ain't the best of the situation you could be in, but if one of my girlfriends was to tell me, like, I don't know what to do. Better take I'm care in, of that kid. I'm in this bad situation, but I'm pregnant. I would be like, go get a job. You got nine months. Time to, your business. Time to, be, because time to be grown now. You got to put your grown woman panties on. Right. You was grown enough to have that child while you was doing it. They could be grown enough to go and get you a job. Like, I'm I'm just saying that because my mom was struggling, okay? And she was able to do it on her own with no family support, no nothing. She actually had my dad's side of the family bashing her the whole time of her pregnancy. And she still did good. So, you mean to tell me you can't go and get you a job? And she even had to go to, she would go to work, big old belly, and be on the bus like that. Oh, that's... You're carrying a whole extra weight. So, crazy. for the thing is, I feel like you can do it. Thing is, people don't motivate their friends to do better. You got to. Okay. If it's a real friend, that's what they do. Do yeah. motivate. You got to your friend. Help out. You see your friend on this sitting on his butt. Yeah. Get exactly. up. Get Let's up. go. Yes. If that's you your friend. Time. That's what you would say. Because our mom said it to me no, numerous times. Yeah. My friends used to tell me that all the time. You I can't start, be around me. I anymore. started getting comfortable yeah. with makeup stuff. And just a certain amount of clients and stuff. And they was like, bro, like you're just sitting around. Yeah. It's the same thing. You can't sit around. So, and I'll get mad sometimes, but I would be like, you know what they saying is. What about all them ain't your friends? Facts. I was gonna say, friends is a big word. Well, Tina. You really think about it. Tina would mainly be the one telling me that. Like, shout out Tina. I what love do you Tina. think? What do you think this YouTube stuff's working? Because you only do a video once a once a month, blah, blah blah. Like, I wasn't being consistent in my videos. And I was like, yeah, it's gonna work. Like, I was start, I would start having an attitude with her, but it was like she was right. I was just sitting on my ass, or working other jobs instead of focusing on that for real. Mm-hmm. Gotta grind it all times. Mm -hmm. Don't let them come to a sleeper but a dream. Mm. Period. Say that one again. Say don't let them come to a sleeper but a dream. It's a powerful word right there. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You can't be around me and not do something. Right. I never got how a motherfucker could be talking to me about they mans or Oh yeah, this that, and I'm looking at your situation like that don't motivate you. Right. Okay. I think we talking to me about that friend or somebody. Yeah, man, and I'm trying to figure it out. My man just did this, and he. Oh yeah. Oh, like how they found a way out or something. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like oh yeah. So why you ain't doing it, huh? Right, and a lot of people confuse that with hating. Mm -hmm. Yeah, look at the situation and hate on it instead of looking at the situation and. Learning from it, you know what I'm saying? And following it and doing it your own way. That's what this world is, learning. Mm -hmm. Like, I got a brother. And I just don't get his whole theory on life. Like, I don't get how you can sit here and tell me you so tired of doing this, but you don't have a job. Right. You get what I'm saying? Or, mm -hmm. And God bless you to walk, talk, right. hear, 
with life with all your there. with all your senses mm -hmm. you telling me what you can't do when God can make it to where you really can't do it and it ain't because you don't want to there's no we could life is short so don't take it for granted that's a fact man and a lot of stuff we take for granted like a being lot. able to do this yeah once true. you can't do this no more you will see how important this right. really is seeing hearing mm -hmm. feeling like all that breathing anything this world's so amazing having a, a freaking arm i remember i seen this video on twitter of a guy with no arms so, and he was such a good painter a painter yeah with his feet with his feet with his crazy. feet he, he didn't have both his arms that's crazy i'm like what that's talent that's talent and that's making a way uh -huh. right this dude on instagram was doing it was doing it with like different objects like a mm -hmm. hat just like a whole bunch of the shoe feet just kept going i love the heart of a crab Dude. Cause there's so much meat in there. That's not the heart of it. Yeah, it is. That's the you heart. just taught me something new. I thought that was a claw. I thought it was. These that. are claws. This is the heart of it. Hmm. Somebody. Else. Somebody. That oh, makes yeah. sense. Yeah, someone. Right. Someone going That's crazy over there. The important. So go check it Scrab out. Crab legs are great. Mm -hmm. great. Sorry if we're like, not really. Yeah, I'm pretty focused on these crab legs because honestly, I haven't had crab legs in a long time and uh, It's really kind of tough for me to get these open without some scissors. So for the first part, sometimes I was it really, really is struggling tough. Sometimes it's tough to get in there Get in there mm -hmm. I feel like you're getting stuck with these scissors Painting with his feet, huh? Yeah. Yep. Feet for real I wish I was could it like it. really good too? Man, it was like crazy what? good too. It was huh? like a not like painting like water and trees. I'm talking about a whole portrait of somebody. Oh, so oh, people. Wow. People is hard. I was like, wow. Oh wow, that's that's crazy. So not only that, out. I've seen it. I've seen it in Mexico before too, where it's really old women making tortillas with two fingers. Tortilla with two fingers. Handmade ones, and they're selling it. Like it's listen, it's ways to make money. Mm -hmm. Right. Like some people got a story, but honestly, some people don't. Yeah. Some people honestly don't. And really, I think it's this generation for real. We got lazy. Like there's jobs out here. I, I mean, I don't know what people go through out here. Yeah, me either. So I can't really just say like that. But there's jobs out here. Just gotta like look hard. But yes, you don't know what people go through by the same excuse me. At the same time, that doesn't take away from you still being motivated to do something. Right. What you mean, man? Like, let's say for example, somebody don't got no car. Mm -hmm. So it's hard for them to go find a job just mm -hmm. like that. Versus somebody that had a car and just staying on their butt. Okay. You ain't got a car? But just because you ain't got a car, you ain't going to be like, all right, well, can't go to work, can't find a job. Right. You're going to be like, okay, what do I like? Do I like doing makeup? Do I like, am I good at this? Am I good at, you know, right. have that mentality. Got to find that outlet. Mm-hmm. Whatever it is. Especially if you want to be like. That's not even an excuse. To not having a car is not an excuse to me. Mm -hmm. God, they made so much transportation. Right. You got buses, even though you don't want to take them sometimes. Had a big old belly right in the bus. You could take off, start walking too. Right. It's, like, it's all about how determined you is right. to mm -hmm. be successful. How much do you want it? You know what I'm saying? If you, that's just say a 30 minute walk, but you know this is what you gotta do, mm -hmm. I bet you can walk that 30 minutes. Oh, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Right now, if I lost it all and I put food in my son, my, I have to walk 30 minutes. I'll do that. I'm gonna have to walk. Oh yeah, most definitely. Because I want my son to see that. That when it's not a way, you make a way. Period. I know everybody's had that one time, two times, or however many times that they had to really go through that struggle. Man, what? Heck yeah. Mm -hmm. 
I used to cry to my dad all the time, like, when stuff wasn't going my way, when I wanted. That's my problem. What? I be trying to, um, and I hate that about myself, but I think I'm really starting to change that now. Um, I hate that I look, I put, I look at my situation, I be like, this ain't where I'm supposed to be. Mm -hmm. So that, that, um, kind of like unmotivates me a little bit. And I'm like, well, it's not working. So I find another, I don't finish stuff because I'm not where I think I should have been. Right. Well, you got to understand. Oh, this takes so time. So I try to find another way of making money right. when I could just be consistent at it, consistent at it. And maybe it will go that way. It's and just life's about being consistent. You can't let the world speed you up or dictate dictate your your pace of life. Mm -hmm. You always gonna be unsatisfied. Mm -hmm. Everybody shines at different times. Mm -hmm. Sir, I started changing that mindset though. When I ain't gonna lie, to, I used to cry to my dad all the time. Like oh, it's not working for me. That. <laughs> but once I started like. When I became Christian and was going to Bible study and stuff, mm -hmm. that's when I really started changing my mind. When did you start doing all that? Mm, I converted like a year ago. Mm. But I didn't really start going to the stuff until like a couple months ago, like be beginning of this year. Mm. I was in there heavy too, like crying and all that. You would have thought I was going yeah. through. I need to get this a little flat. Why? Burn my throat too much. You want some water? Mm -mm. All right, y'all. I tackled a lot of crab legs and so did Essie and Amon. Y'all, I hope you guys enjoyed that video of these crab. What kind of crab legs are these? Mm -hmm. Well, we're going to say snow crab. It is. I was, <laughs> it is snow crab. I was busy burping, sorry. Excuse okay. Me. Yeah. So, snow crab. I hope you guys enjoyed this snow crab glass table talk with Armand and Essie. Um, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, like usual. Thumbs up. And we out this thing. We'll Peace meet out. you here again. We'll see you again at the glass <laughs> table. Love y'all. At 9 p.m. Central. <laughs>